What's up, YouTube? I'm here in a place called Sierra de los Tres Cruces, and that's the bus that just, just dropped me off. Um, I guess it comes once every 20 minutes. I'm going to go up a mountain, and we're going to see what it's like. Supposedly, there's a gym up there, up on top. So real quick, guys, I want to tell you, if you want to come here, it's like going to cost you like two bucks, less than that, if you use the metro. It'll cost you from La Palma, where you take the Metro Plus and you, you transfer it, um, it's, it'll cost you 15,000 pesos, which is about $4.87. Uh, I'd rather save the $4.87 and take the bus and get the experience, but it's quite a view, if you can see. So um, remember, La Palma, and then you take the bus C3-007, okay? There's C3-007A, but there's C3-007. Okay, this is the entrance. They got like a little Virgin Mary here. The Virgin de Mil Milagrosa. Okay, and this is where it comes from. This is where you go. This is where they're coming from. So, I didn't even know this place existed. Okay, and I, I don't see many stuff on any travel channels about this place, but it's a great place to go if you want to get away from the city and do something for yourself get a nice workout in especially on a Sunday there's some of the views coming up the mountain okay got a little fruit stand if you want to get food and look look how nice the city looks air's a lot a lot easier to breathe over here not the pollution but it's a good hike because you, as you can see as you can see it's a nice hike Okay guys, you might want to know this if you're coming up here by yourself or with your girlfriend or or whatever. There's a left there's a left path that goes up the mountain and there's a right path. The right path is easier. Okay? It's easier to climb. This is really cool, man. You just like scale this. Okay. So, I'm about halfway to the top. This is their little playground gym over here. They got a playground and as you can see, it goes way high. Um, and it's Sunday. It's about 4, 4.30. Sun is starting to set. Um, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to continue to go up. There's not a lot of people here. Maybe I'll get a, good, a little workout in before I... I'm about halfway up. I can feel it. Uh, and look at this view. It's just fan magnificent. Really great way to... Spend a Sunday afternoon, you know? Just come and think, do some reflection, work on yourself. Think about what you're gonna do for the week. New goals, new strategies. Okay, see you at the top. It's all about the cross, man. Remembrance on Sunday of Jesus' death and burial and resurrection. And the beautiful city he's given me in my life. Medellin, Colombia. Finally made it to the top. This is what you find. There's a there's a little store over there. Some guy smoking weed, which uh, which is cool with me. You know, I'm gonna get some water. No way, man. No way you're climbing up this thing and not want to get water. You're gonna be super dry. Okay, so this is the top. The top. They got horses over here that are just roaming freely. They got a whole weight bench. They got like people, um, you know, flying kites. They got dogs without leashes. It's free over here, man. I mean, no rules. I mean, you know, people respect each other. It's like human nature, human decency. You know, it's not like regulated where everything's so strict. That's what I love about this place. I love about this city, this country. It's a free country. So, anyway, it's what it is. It's what it looks like. There's people here working out cement weights. I'm going to get up and get after it. Just do my stomach routine. And this is the view. This is what you see. That's a steep drop, man. Aquí hay una patada. Uh, ay, ya por la luz. 
Oh, almost stepping some uh, a landmine there. But these are the, these are the horses. Come up here with some uh, with some motorcycles. You're looking at a nice nice ride. Woo! So I got to the top, and let me tell you about the ground and the footing. Look here comes this horse. He's going to check me out. Horsey. Say hello. You're not too friendly, are you? Anyway, um, you, you can you can come with tennis shoes. I got these running shoes on, and it's per perfectly fine. They got a little boxing, little punching bag up here, which I think God's trying to tell me I need to stay in a boxing like like I need to. I don't really want to because it's really really hard, especially when you start training the. On the punching bag and just getting in the physical condition of boxing and the mental conditioning of it but uh it's definitely definitely a sign that i'm on the, i'm on the right path and uh it's 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 worth it it'll take you a good two it's it'll take you a good half an hour to 45 minutes if you're in shape maybe even longer if you're not maybe about an hour to get up here but it's worth it and there is yeah, I got water. I got a bag of water. You want to get a bottle of water, it's 2,000 pesos, which is under a dollar. If you want to get a little bag of water, which I did, it's 500 pesos for each little bag. So definitely worth it. And there's the, there's the shop. They got drinks and stuff like that. This is uh, coming down the mountain. Got kids coming up. Got parents coming up. And I'm coming down. Been up here for a while, got my workout in. Just the beauty, great view. Fantastic view of the city. Probably the best view of the city since um, since I went paragliding. So, definitely, definitely worth it. Worth every penny that it was to get here. Just thought we'd get another quick panoramic shot here. How wonderful and where the location of the city is. And, uh, what you find when you get to the top.